What's up everybody, it's Mike and Lauren. We're here at iCast and this is Real Cool Adventures and today we're looking for stuff that's new, coming out into the market. We're gonna put it down, we're gonna find it right now. All right, so I'm Mike and we're with Real Cool Adventures. I'm here with my buddy Robert. And this is the man of war, our favorite indicator species to catching tuna. Lots of large uh, fish offshore, but check out this cool feature his knife has. Not only is it sharp, sharper than anything I've ever felt in my life, it comes with a honing. Honing rod, honing rod. ceramic sharpener. How many of you have ever seen that ever? How it's many the, of you ever needed that when you didn't have it? It's the first and only knife with a ceramic sharpener built to the handle. In the world. In the world. Look at that. You always have a sharpener with you. Hey, I'm Mike with Cross Kicks, and we're at 2021 iCast in Orlando, Florida. Thanks for coming to check out our brand. We have the 2.0 and the APX. You can see APX has an elastic lace system that's set up, so you can tighten these or loosen them to however is comfortable, and you can actually use them as slip-ons at that point, so they're easy to get on and off. Cross kicks have vent and drain holes built in, so they drain quick and dry fast. The EVA foam material has natural antimicrobial properties. So they're really easy to clean off. If they get really musty from fishing all day, a little soap and water goes a long ways. You can see the traction is anti-mar for your boat and also has great traction for boat surfaces and slick surfaces. The 2.0, doesn't have laces, it has a strap, and it has a more relaxed fit. So if you have a little bit wider a foot, the 2.0 is for you. This is a one-piece construction. It's very comfortable, and even if this is the shoe you take on and off for leisure living, or you're doing sports in it, Cross Kicks is for you. Thanks for joining. Go to crosskicks.com, let us know if you have any questions. Another thing, another feature that these have that I really like, they have a softer rubber that you can't see. It's hard to tell in the pictures online or anywhere you're gonna find them. This rubber is actually softer than the side and it won't give you blisters in the back of your heel, on your kid's heels, your wife's heels, or your ex-mother-in-law's. You might want to just rip that off. It's real light, it's easy. The reel's nice and easy. The handle actually has a rubberized grip. That's very comfortable in the hand. What you got there? We're at the Zepco booth here at iCast. And this is one of the main sales reps. This is Caleb, and he's showing us around today. And right here, we have one of Lauren's favorite rods. That's a Zepco spinning rod. And uh, she had the flexibility. That's why she doesn't lose fish and sets world records because of that action right there. It doesn't force you to pull the hook out of the fish's mouth, allows you to get up the dock without daddy screaming, yelling, and we'll show you that in the next video. So once again, you know, I'm really not an organization person. I'm really not organized, but all that's about to change because we're gonna start getting into a lot of, sorry, turn my back on you, a lot of this type of equipment helps you actually see the stuff that you have melting in the side of your car seat. And a lot of this other stuff is contained and has a lid on it that keeps the stuff from melting and it keeps your tackle a lot nicer. How many of you out there would like to see something like this right here? Show up at your doorstep loaded full of tackle. Give us a big thumbs up and that might happen. I'm here with Fred and he has the number one product in this whole building. We're gonna check it out. He's gonna explain it to you right now. Right, so this is the Boom Boom Frog. We, uh, we actually released it several years ago. We had the new Poppin' version come out um, just actually last year. And uh, what it is, it's, it's a topwater hollow belly frog, but it's got frog fur on the back. And what that does, if you look at a fish, a bass's mouth, or most fish anyway, it's like the hook part of Velcro. And you've got the loop part here. So when they grab it, they can't blow it back out. So you're gonna get much better hookup ratio and catch more fish. We got the poppin' version, it walks real easy. And another wow. little deal, you'll notice it's got a real heavy clevis. Mm -hmm. By having a heavy clevis and then the, the balanced weight, when you walk it, every time you snap your rod, it's gonna walk back and forth. Well, 
when you kill it, it's actually going to give it an extra hop. Right. So it's got something a little unique on top of the frog burp. And so. another major advantage, if any of you out there fish with children, you know how hard it is to teach a kid to set the hook. With this, you don't have to set the hook. Once that fish bites it, this is locked in its mouth. Once it turns the opposite way, that hook is really razor sharp. It's in the fish's lip, and your hookup ratio is 100% right there because of this. And what you're gonna, next time you see this, is gonna be in a video going down next week. Look at that. Lauren's a happy camper. That's Thank gonna you. work. How many of you out there wanna see us use this rod right there? And I'll tell you what, after the video's over, Put it something down below and we'll actually get you one of these. He'll mail it to you. That's comfortable. Gets all the odors out. This is the latest and greatest, foolproof, guaranteed to catch something lure that's coming out of ICAST 2021 right now. This is my buddy Mitch. And these are all the samples of what you're gonna see us use soon. This patented technique and design agitates the water and it gets all those top water breeding fish from the Amazon to come up and bite. And he's gonna go ahead and show us now, how many of you would like to have that in your tackle box? So, what we did is we pulled two of our best-selling sizes okay. from our freshwater market. We improved all the hardware on it so that it could handle toothy critters in a saltwater environment. So we've got stainless steel hardware throughout. We've got Fusion 19 hooks uh, on here that have a strong anti-corrosion resistance to them. Uh, the pull strength, the pull test that we've done on the hook hangers is 50 pounds. So something grabs a hold of this, it's not going to be the lure that's going to get uh, pulled apart. It'll probably, yeah, it'll probably be your line or your knot before it is the lure. Uh, but this is in our new uh, Berkeley packaging. So when you're in a store, take a look for this. You'll see our red, black, and white packaging. Uh, this is the kind of the livery we're going to have on all of our new product going forward. I like it. You like what you see? So you also see we have it include a mirror, a mirror insert. Let's see it really clearly. Well, look at that transparent film on the side. It actually shows the depth of the fish, and it kind of lets you see the whole rib cage, and it's real lifelike action. Yep. So you can see the pattern that we have on here. Really gives a lot of great reflections in the in the water, just with the sun hitting off it multiple places. So you're going to see a couple of things on the chopo. You know, one again, the stainless steel hardware. We've got micro washers in between the propeller in the front and the back so it stays free and is free to move. You can see it's just gonna move very freely. In, uh, in hot conditions, the other thing that's important about this, the material we use, this is not gonna deform in the heat. So that's something you We've might see. We've had that problem with other lures in the past. Where the, where the actual material will break down in the back seat of your car, you go fishing and it's hung up, or it binds because it melts. This will not do that. And because you leave everything in your car, too. And that's a fact. So this is our 105 size, so you'll see it has a just a great top water presentation. You can either just cast and retrieve, or you can just give it a rip as well, just to get some intermittent action you know, going on the surface moves and throws a lot of water actually puts out a pulsating vibrating the more you move water a lot of fish have nerves down their whole body body and this helps them in a dark water condition find their target they feel it move they can lock on hone in and bam it's over that's our saltwater chopper What's up guys, Mike Schmidt with Hooker Electric. We're at iCast 2021, we're super excited. We got a brand new product release. It's our patent pending tuna tube recirculating bucket. It's got a 750 gallon per hour pump pushing three tubes. This is a system for live bait that's already hooked. You drift in too quick and you wanna reset. You put your baits back in these tubes and you go back out to the depth you were fishing, redeploy your baits. It's also good for charter guys, fishing with the kids, you're running weed lines. You have three baits pre-hooked, ready to go. Once you see the fish, you fire them out, one, two, three, and you're ready to go. You can roll around all day with baits. We recommend changing the water out one to two times a day. The water doesn't really get hot with this pump, it's pretty cool. It actually recirculates and adds a little bit of oxygen. So you have your baits ready to go. When opportunity meets preparation, you're game on. That's amazing. What's your favorite fish to catch? I'd say probably snook. Snook? Have you caught any of the uh, bullseye snakehead fish? Do you no. like to? 
Yes, I would. How many of you out there want to see this guy catch a giant snakehead fish? Give us a big thumbs up and it's going to go down in the next couple weeks. This is my buddy. Check him out. That's his nickname written right there. Also known as Tarzan. Yeah. And we'll see you on the next adventure.